with the EA Games error on our end crash? You're not alone. This issue has been driving players crazy, but today, I'm breaking down the exact fixes that actually work. Stick with me because I'll cover step-by-step -step methods that go way beyond the basic advice you usually see online. By the end of this video, your EA app should be running smoothly, and you'll be back in game without the headache. Why this error happens? First, let's quickly talk about what this error really means. The message, it's on our end, makes it sound like the problem is always EA's servers. But in most cases, it's a mix of things. Corrupted cache in the EA app, broken login tokens, Windows network conflicts, or background services interfering with the launcher. So, fixing it requires a layered approach. One, clear the EA app cache. Start by clearing out the EA app's cached files. This resets broken login data that triggers the crash. Here's how. Close EA app completely. Go to C colon backslash users backslash your name backslash app data backslash local backslash electronic arts backslash EA desktop backslash cache. Delete everything inside the cache folder. Restart the EA app. This alone fixes the error for a lot of players. Two, run EA app as administrator. Sometimes, Windows blocks the EA app from reading or writing system files. To fix that, right-click EA app properties compatibility tab. Check run this program as administrator. Apply and restart. This removes permissions errors that can trigger the crash. Three, reset your EA app login token. If you're still stuck, the login token might be corrupted. Sign out of the EA app. Close it completely from Task Manager. Now relaunch and log back in with your EA account. That forces a fresh authentication session with EA servers. Four, flush your DNS and reset network. This error can also be tied to network conflicts. Let's reset your DNS. Open command prompt as admin. Type IP protocol configuration slash flushedins and hit enter. Then type netwinsock reset and press enter. Restart your PC. This clears out bad connections that might block EA's servers. Five, reinstall the EA app, clean install. If nothing else works, you'll need a full clean reinstall. Uninstall EA app from Windows. Delete leftover folders and app data and program files. Then download the latest version from EA's official website. A clean reinstall wipes out all corrupted configs that may be behind the crash. Six, check EA server status. And finally, don't forget, sometimes the issue really is on EA's side. Head over to the EA help website or check down detector to see if servers are down. If they are, the only fix is waiting until EA resolves it. And that's it, six proven fixes for the EA games error on our end crash. Start with clearing your cache and working your way down the list and you should be back in game in no time. If this guide helped you, drop a like and let me know which fix worked for you in the comments. And if you're serious about smooth gaming, make sure to subscribe because I post regular fixes and optimization guides for every new PC title. Don't waste time stuck on errors, get back to gaming faster. And before you go, over 95% of you watching right now aren't subscribed. If this video helped you fix support the channel by clicking that subscribe button, it's completely free and helps me make more real, no fluff guides just like this. Join the small percentage of subscribers who get early access to my best content. Don't miss out. Thanks for watching. Now go enjoy your game. I don't ever slow up. No, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you want to play tough and want to hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I don't ever slow up. No, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you want to play tough and want to hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement.